welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here, and today we're back with another unboxing for Support Small Business Sunday. Now, I did this unboxing in two parts, so you will notice in the next clip that my bracelets changed because I did it in two parts because they came in separately. Y'all y'all know the whole mess. Anyways, so this box here comes to us from JL Maverick Inc. It is a pin turner over on Etsy, and they asked me if I would be willing to show a couple of their pins. And of course, I was like, sure, because you guys know I like to support small business. So I picked out a pin design that I like, and we're going to take a look at it. So um, it's a veteran shop over on Etsy, and it's run by John and Abby Lewis. So thank you, John and Abby, for sending this out to me. Um, I'm going to open it this way so you guys don't see my address, because y'all don't need to know where I live. So when you open up the box, it has a little card in there for me. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Look at their, their business card. That's pretty slick. And then that's all their deets over on Etsy, their email, veteran crafted pens and woodwork. So thank you, John and Abby, for sending this out. I even got a cool little butterfly sticker. So the card says, Alicia, I hope you love this new pen. It's one of my favorite colors as well. Let us know if Etsy messages what you think of it or if, it's, if you talk about it in a video so we can watch. Abby and John. Well, thank you, Abby and John. Hey, by the way, Abby and John, I'm opening it in a video. Um, so we're going to take a look at it. We got some paper in here. I like their box has their branding on it. That's cool. Whoa. Okay, so we have a nine placer that came with it. They have their own little stickers with their branding name on it. So let's take a look at this pen. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. So let's see if we can get this big mamma jamma out of here. Oh, <gasps> whoa, look at that. That's pretty cool. Okay, so I love the colors. I love the iridescent color in there, if you can see it in that blue. Look at that. And then all the lumps. I like the lumps because they fit nicely in my hand. Uh, it, it is really comfortable. It's not super hard. So that's cool. Now, I don't usually use the fat placers. These are the fat placers. I don't usually typically use those. I actually use the thin placers. So let me find a thin placer. So here we go. Bam. Oh my gosh, you guys. That is gorgeous. Very well made. I love it. I love, love, love the swirly colors. Now, I'm not typically... Uh, Jordan. Sorry, Mr. Coffee's here. What color is this? Is that green red? And yellow. Oh, it's green and yellow. Okay. It. I don't usually do big pops of this color because this color is really hard for me to see. But it actually looks really good when it goes up into this color. So I really liked it. So that's why I picked this one. But oh my gosh, that's so pretty. So if you are looking for a new pin shop to check out, Think about checking out JL Maverick Inc. I will, of course, link them down below. So thank you to John and Abby. I will definitely be going over. And as I'm looking at their shop right now, they are fully stocked. They have the little miniature pins and they have the bigger pins like this. They have all kinds of lumps and bumps in their pins. So I would highly suggest you guys check them out. They even have some of the blanks for you to choose from to see which one you would like them to turn for you. So, yeah. Customer service was really good. They they respond hella quick whenever I message them. So I I really, really like this. I definitely will, will be going over to check them out. So I think you should too. Um, let's give these small businesses some love. So that is awesome. So thank you, John and Abby. I will definitely be using this to show you to tell you guys how I feel about holding it in my hand for long periods of time. Because you, you got to do more than just show it. You got to be able to actually use it. Because if you can't use it, I mean... I actually like the way the bumps are in this one because it literally contours to like the inner part of my hand here. So I don't have this big lump sitting on it. So, oh, definitely. Yes, 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 yes. Definitely using this. So thank you, John and Abby again. And we're going to go over to the next clip and see what the next small business is. Now, this unboxing comes to us from painting with diamonds, not paint with diamonds, painting ING with diamonds. So, I saw Wolfpack Diamond Painting unbox one of these in her live one night. And I want to say it was like the, the December box. 
And so I was like, oh, I want to go try this company because I think Rachel Ray has tried them as well. And I was like, oh, I, I want to give them a try. I'll give them a go. I, I like trying new things. So I went over to the website and she had her Valentine's Day boxes up for sale. So I went ahead and ordered. I ordered this on January 7th. And I received it on February 22nd. Um, it did take a little bit to get to me. There was a disclaimer that it was going to take three to four weeks to uh, to arrive. So I wasn't worried about the wait. I knew it wouldn't get here in time for Valentine's Day. I was kind of hoping that it would be packaged better than this. Because when I got it, I don't know if I can show you without showing you my address. It was open. Okay, like it, it was open. And so I'm really hoping that what I paid for did not fall out because I, I paid a good bit for this. And so I was kind of hoping that the packaging would be better. So packaging wise, she gets a two out of five for me. So we're going to go ahead and open this up and see what's in here. And again, I'm trying to hide my address. So when you open it up, this is what you see. So it looks like we have some candy. We have some release covers. What is that? We're going to put that up to the side. We have a heart-shaped tray and handmade something. What is this? Harmful to aquatic life. What? Okay. What is this? I don't even know what that is. Is that wax? Is that supposed to be like wax or something? Okay. I, I think this is some kind of wax. Okay. So we have the heart-shaped tray and some wax. We have this little tin here with a cover minder on it. Let's see what's in here. Oh, we have multi-placers. So we have multi-placers and a heart-shaped plate of wax. And this looks like it has the thin placers and straighteners as well. So that's really cool. Let's see what else is in this little box. If we can get it out. Ooh, okay. We also have the drill grinder, which whenever you have drills that are stuck together, you put this in, turn gently. You don't want to put pressure on it because you'll crush your drills. You just turn gently and it'll break apart drills that are stuck together. So we have that. We have a card, cover minder, needle minder. What? Oh, I'm guessing this was supposed to be on here. So we're going to put that on there. So it's cover minder, needle minder. In case you're someone who cross like does things, ooh, we have we have trays, the stoppers. Whoa, that's cool. All right, hold, hold, okay, we gotta figure out how to get this back on here. There we go. And then it has a top to it. How cool is that? Now I don't remember seeing this that was supposed to come in the box. So like this is this is all new to me. Okay, that's hella cool. Okay, all right then. So when you're done diamond painting, so like if you're diamond painting, you gotta go cook dinner real quick. So you're gonna be finishing up your diamond painting when you're done. Put the top on it so nothing can get into it. I like that. I like that a lot. And then of course, well, seems, seems like we have nice deep ridges. We'll try it out with some drills here in a few minutes. See how it, how it works. Um, it has this cool little stopper here to stop your drills from falling out, which is a plus because that's one problem I have all the time with my drills and my trays that they, they fall out. It's a nice wide tray. I do prefer bigger trays. So even though it's not a bigger tray, it is wide. So we'll try some drills out in that in a few minutes. Let's see what else we got in this box. And I paid, I think it says 46 euros. So I'm not sure what that is in the US. We have a broken piece of heart. I broke her heart, apparently. Or she broke my heart, I guess. We have handmade soap, lemon, and peppermint. You got heart things. We have another one of those cool funnels that, you know, Maggie stole. We have a pink funnel. And everything in here is supposed to be like a Valentine's Day thing, which is why everything's like pink and purples and stuff. Ooh. We have this. What is this? Cover minor. It says cover minor need reminder, but I don't see another. Okay. We have more candy. We have washi tape with hearts on it. Get all this paper out of here. We got we got that. Here's the other cover minder. Oh, it has a cute little unicorn on it. 
I think I ordered this one separately. Did I order this separately? Because I was looking at this and I was like, ooh, I really want that. So we have this crazy looking unicorn. And we got some more candy. Put that candy in there. And it says, handmade diamond painting products, pens and tools, replacement covers, diamond painting trays, 3D printed shelves and stands, 3D themed gift boxes, sticky mats, blue wax, and storage. And it's email at paint with diamond, paintingwithdiamonds.co.uk or you can go to the website www.paintingwithdiamonds.co.uk and then there's some of the products that she offers. Look how cool that tray is. I might have to go back and get one of those. And then of course they have the pen stand and little um, scoop. You got your replacement covers. You got your tin. We got pretty much everything that's there here. Except for like this thing, which is like the cutter, and then we didn't get the stackable tray or the thing, which you can go back on the website and order it again. She does have her social media up there, so I will link it down below. What do we have in here? Hold on a second if I can get this out. Ooh, creamy white. Creamy white pen. And then what else do we have in here? What is that? What is that? It's flat. Oh my gosh. That's kind of cool. Okay. We have rounded tweezer, but these have a little bit of girth to them. They're a little girthy. Um, they have pink sparkles in them, y'all. Look at that. It matches my pen I got from Diamond Pen Pal. That's so cool. And they're rounded, but they're, they're a little bit heavier than normal tweezers. So it looks like she put resin, like glitter and resin on top and let it harden. So that's really cool. And now that you're down into the business, you can take a look at this beautiful pen. It's funny, I'm so used to the big thick pens that when I hold pens like this, I feel like I'm gonna break it, like I'm gonna incredible hawk it or something. But it's a beautiful creamy white pen. What would have made this super cool if she would have added some little hearts inside of it for Valentine's Day, that would have been super cute. But I do like the little creamy white pen. And then of course, like I said, we have the cover minder. So we have this crazy unicorn and this heart shape uh, one with the roses on it. We have this beautiful washi tape. This was totally worth the money. I have to I have to admit, I'm a little disappointed about the box. I'm not going to lie because I believe Wolfpack had a really nice, like, flat, thin box that all of her stuff came in. So I'm a little disappointed about the janky box. But for the most part, like, I'm pretty happy. Like, this was totally worth it. Because, I mean, just an acrylic pen usually runs you about $35. Bucks. Um, so to get this, and it was it was 46 euros. I want to say that's like $56, 56, 57 dollars. So it that's actually a really good price for her gift boxes. And I think she still has these on sale. I think they were still on her website. If they are, I will link them. If not, I will link just link the shop. But I want to test out these trays because like the ridges are really nice and deep. And I love the tin with the the placers in it. That's a great place to keep placers and it has the resin on top with the little hearts. Still not sure what this is. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is a... Uh, hold up. Will this fit on here? No, of course not. Because it's a different shape. Duh. It'll fit kind of in there. Is I don't know if this is wax or soap. Handmade. It just says Manchester. I don't know if this is wax or soap. Um, smells good. I don't know. I'll have to ask her. And then this one, I know it's soap because it says handmade soap. So I'll have to ask her if this is soap or if this is wax. So, there's that. And then we have those release covers as well. So, for those folks that live over in the UK and you don't want to order from Star Or because she ships from China. And that takes a while for you guys, I know. Um, you can also order the release covers from Diamond Painting with, or, I'm sorry, Painting with Diamonds UK. We have this little heart and we have this little purple one with the top. I really like these. These are really cool. Alright, so let's try some drills in them, shall we? So, let's get some drills out. We're gonna get out these drills. Which I'm shocked that the drill trays weren't pink for Valentine's Day instead of purple. I love purple, don't get me wrong, but I'm just saying it's Valentine's and yeah, so here we go. So we're gonna put that down. We're gonna shake, shake. You also wanna make sure you don't overfill the tray because that's what I just did. So we're gonna pour some of these. Pours out real nice. Nothing getting stuck. So that's a plus. So got a little bit too much in there. There we go. Let's let's go with that. We can rock with that. 
There we go. So let's shake them around. Shake it down. They line up nice. Look at the sparkle on those drills. Yes. All right. So I really do like these drill trays. Definitely give her, we'll, we'll give her two, we'll, we'll give her a thumb up and a half. Packaging needs a little work. But, because presentation is everything, y'all. I'm just saying, presentation is everything. And I was really upset when I got that out of the mailbox yesterday and it was open. Now, that part's not her fault that it was open. That's the USPS. That's that's their fault. But I would have thought it would have been in something a little bit bigger, like a, like a flat box maybe, so that the stuff wasn't so jam-packed together. Because one good drop or step on, that would have been done. Anyways, um, so I, 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 I like the box. I say it's totally worth getting the, the gift boxes. I'm not going to lie. Um... The tops to these are really cool. I like that. Let's see how well they work. We're going to flip that upside down. Look at it like a sandwich. Does it stick to the top? Nope. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay, this has to be my favorite part of this box. All right. And then we have this heart-shaped one. And I like the fact that the tops go on the bottom so you don't lose them because Lord knows I'm going to lose it. All right. So we're going to... Tap that back in there like this. Do it like that. Bada bing, bada boom. Look at that, see? And this is why you need those stoppers. So let's try this out. How is this heart going to hold up to lining up drill? <gasps> Look at it. It lines them up really good. She has. She definitely has down the depth of the lines that need to be on the inside to keep the drills to line up. So I do like that. Um, if you have not tried diamond painting, or I'm sorry, I keep calling it diamond painting. If you have not tried Painting with Diamonds UK, totally say her gift her gift boxes are totally worth it. Like, like I said, the packaging, eh. But I can deal with the packaging if I'm getting a good product, and these are good products. Um, nice, sturdy, 3D printed trays. They don't seem flimsy or like I'm going to break them. I love the fact that these came with tops. I love the fact that you also got multi-placers in a tin, which, of course, you could use to hold your cover minders on. Got the cool cover minders with it as well. We also got a pink funnel. We got whatever this is. Again, I will I will figure out what the hell this is. It just says not it says harmful to aquatic life. I'm not sure why you have aquatic life next to it, so I'm gonna guess it's possibly hand soap. Again, I will ask her, it will pop up on the screen for you. We did get some hand soap that is in a shape of wax or shape of wax, shape of hearts. We got replacement papers. We got these really cool tweezers. We got this pen. We got all kinds of... We got washi tape. We got a drill grinder. All of that. All of... Oh, look, 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 at, look, at, look at all of that. And we got candy. There's more candy in the box over there. But it's over there. Um, all this for like 55, 56 bucks. Uh, less than 60 bucks for two tray, three trays. Drill grinder, pen, tweezers, minders, tin... With multi-placers, funnel, wax, soap, definitely worth it. Two thumbs up for Miss Coffee. I give her two thumbs up. I will definitely be visiting her shop again. So thank you to Painting with Diamonds for this beautiful box. I did pay for this by myself, by the way. I just want to thank her because it came safely. And I hope everything that was supposed to be in it is still in it. But thank you also for watching. If you have any questions, comments, concerns about this unboxing, please leave them down in the description box. Or description box. You can't write in there. You write in the comment section. So write all your comments, questions, comments, or concerns down in the comment section below. And I'll do my best to get to them as soon as quickly as possible. But with that said, I got to get out of here because as you can already tell, I'm getting tongue-tied. So always remember to wear your mask, wash your hands, don't touch your face, keep your six feet, and always try. Be kind. Be courteous. Be cool.